the story of a Kaohsiung woman who continues to volunteer in the community despite problems with her eyesight has touched hearts across Taiwan. The local school, where Wu Meiyi has volunteered for over two decades, recognized the octogenarian with a lifelong service award, showing that each member of the community has a vital role to play. <laughs> A group of children sort through rubbish and recycling with the school's oldest volunteer, Wu Mei Yu. She helps us sweep the ground and she can't see. I think she's so cool. Now 80 years of age, Mei Yu lost the use of her left eye in an accident when she was 11. Once, she struggled to lift her head up, but thanks to her work at the school, she gradually found the courage to meet people with dignity. Back then, when people spoke to me, I used to hang my head down and look away. I guess I was afraid of what would happen if they saw my eye. I was very scared. But then I came out of that, and I feel like I have more and more confidence every day. Naturally introverted, Mei Yu found herself isolated at home after her husband died. But she joined a volunteering group for environmental protection and started to get back into the community. She helps sort the rubbish and recycling at Jiachang Elementary and in the neighborhood office, and she has plenty to do. I'm very happy. Having no work to do is what's tiring. I feel good when I have something to do. Mei Yu suffers from macular degeneration in her right eye, and she might be completely blind one day. The school has made a film about Mei Yu's story and presented her with an award to thank her for her lifelong service. After you gave me this award, you said, you can rest at home from now on, Mei Yu, but that's what I'm afraid of. Having a role to play in the community is a great joy for older citizens like Mei Yu, even as health deteriorates. However many years she's got left, she wants to enjoy them fully.